be given to introduce a bill entitled an act to amend the workplace safety and insurance act 1997 to provide employers with the right to participate in alternate insurance plans and that it now be read for the first time the workplace safety and insurance amendment act alternate insurance plans 2012 this bill amends the workplace safety and insurance act 1997 to allow an employer at any time to opt to participate in an insurance plan that is offered by a private sector insurer instead of the insurance plan established under this act. If the alternative alternate plan offers benefits to the employer's workers that are comparable to those offered by, by the insurance plan as it exists under the act as of the date that the amendments of the act come into force. To exercise this option, an employer is required to file a notice with the Workplace Safety and Insurance Board containing the particulars specified in the regulations made under the Act. If an alternate plan is in force, the employer or any workers of the employer who are affected by a decision of the insurer under the alternate plan may appeal the decision to the Financial Services Tribunal. The bill also repeals the amendments of the Act made by the Workplace Safety and Insurance Amendment Act 2008 which presently do not come into force until January 1st, 2013. Those amendments would have made insurance coverage mandatory in the construction industry for independent operators, sole proprietors, partners and partnerships, and executive offices of corporations. As a result, insurance coverage for those categories of persons in the construction industry revert to being optional. Thank you.